everybody, Mrs. Germany here. Today we're going to look at how to do a sequence of transformations when you have to draw it on the coordinate plane. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our triangle ABC here and we're going to follow the rules that are provided for us to do our, trans to do our transformation. Now, the first thing it asks for us to do is it asks for us to do a translation here and we're going to follow this rule. We're going to go X is going to increase by 6 and Y is going to decrease by 3. So that's going to be the first thing that we're going to do. All right. So as we go to do that, we're going to take and we're going to say, all right, pick one of this, one of these. Now, because X is going to go positive six, which means it's going to go to the right, I'm going to pick either C or B to begin with, just so that I'm not overlapping. So I'm going to go with C and C has to go six to the right. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then it has to go Y negative three, which is down three. So one, two, three. And so I'm going to put a dot right there. And then that is going to be my point C prime. All right. That is going to be my point C prime. Now I'm going to do the same thing with point B. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. That's my right. Now down three, one, two, three. And I'm going to put my dot there. And that is going to be my B prime. All right. So now I've got C prime and B prime. Now I need to go do A. Same process, doesn't change at all. So one, two, three, four, five, six to the right, and then one, two, three to go down. And there I now have my A prime. Now all I'm going to do is I'm simply going to connect these dots as best I can. And I'm not using a straight edge, which normally I would do, but you guys get the picture, all right? So there is my first one, which was a translation. Now I need to go back and look at what is the second thing then that I'm being asked to do. And the second thing I'm being asked to do is I'm being asked to do a reflection over the Y axis. All right. I'm being asked for a reflection over the Y axis. So I'm going to do that same thing where, sorry where what I have is I'm going to start by thinking through what these points are. So reflection over the Y axis, this is my Y axis that I'm going to reflect over. So I'm going to take every single point and I'm just going to move it back to the other side. So since this is going to reflect over the Y axis, I'm going to go one, two, three to get to the Y axis. So I go one, two, three, to where my new point is going to be. And so this becomes my C double prime. All right. Now I do the same thing again. I'm going to use A this time. So A is only one point away from the Y axis. And so one point past it is going to be my A double prime and double prime because it's the second of the transformations. Now I follow those same procedures I'm going to do with B. So one, two, three to get to the axis. One, two, three then to get me to the other side. And so this again becomes B double prime. Now, just like I did before, I'm simply going to draw my lines to connect the dots. And now I have finished my transformation, my sequence of transformations. So I went from my original ABC to the translation followed by the reflection. 